posted, May 25, 2018 6 hours 32 minutes and 39 seconds p.m. MDT Please don't be deceived by recent Republican calls for a quick and neat wrap-up of the Mueller investigation, along with transparently self-serving attacks on the FBI and the intelligence community. See these for what they are, desperate attempts by this criminal administration to evade the inevitable, ever-tightening noose around their shady activities. It is simply a call to end the witch hunt by the witches themselves. Where were these same characters when who knows how many millions of dollars were being spent on multiple, politically motivated probes of the Benghazi incident? The House Select Committee's investigation alone lasted over two years and turned up absolutely no evidence of wrongdoing, whereas the Mueller team has either indicted or gotten guilty pleas from at least 19 people and three entities so far. Trump and his cronies, including the NRA leadership, have more verifiable Russian ties than a Moscow haberdasher. Add to that the money laundering and obstruction of justice on the part of the Trump crime family and it becomes easy to see why they want to dump all over the FBI, the special prosecutor's team and our intelligence services. To those of us who have been closely following these events, at the peril of our own mental health, it is abundantly clear that there are plenty of Congress members, Devin Nunes, Jim Jordan, Dana Rohrabacher, just to name a few, who are scrambling madly to cover up their complicity. The Longer Mueller Don't be fooled by these malefactors and their shrieking propagandists at Fox, Sinclair, Breitbart, Drudge and all the other alt-right outlets. The true believers claim that the investigation is predicated on a story fabricated by liberals who are sore that their candidate lost the election. But in reality it is so far, far more than that. One must hold no particular ideological beliefs to be aware of and appalled by corruption on such a massive scale. Our republic is at a tipping point with an executive who shows more and more authoritarian tendencies daily. Be grateful that Robert Mueller and his expert team of prosecutors is on the case and let them keep working at the job they are so qualified to do. They may be the only real patriots with the power to bring down this conniving band of thieves and traitors. Carrie Wolfson lives in Boulder.